Now we will customize our table of contents. Here we can see that this is the chapter name and then section, subsection. Uh, I also want to put my sub subsection in the table of contents list. So for uh, adding uh, sub subsection, we will have to use uh, one uh, command that is set counter top depth and that is 3. 3 is used for uh, sub subsection. Now let's check. So now this time we can see that our sub subsections are coming in our table of contents and also I want to put the numbers for my sub subsection so for adding numbers we can use again set counter and uh, in a curly bracket just write set num and in a curly bracket second curly bracket just write 3 now you can see that section, subsection, sub subsection. Also, if you want to put numbers for your paragraph, just write here port. Let's check. Yeah. Also, we can uh, remove the dots line and we can put our uh, customized uh, symbols here. So, for that, we will have to use one package which is known as top loft. So, just use here. And now here we will write uh, renew command. In a first curly bracket we will write uh, cft dot and in a second curly bracket keep it blank. So you can see that dots are not coming. Even uh, you can put here your symbol. I want to put uh, asterisk symbol. Yeah, so you can see that. And if you want to put a dot uh, symbols for your chapters, then you, you can do it by using a renew command. So just use the renew command. And in a first curly bracket, we'll write CFT, chapter for chapter, and then dot separation. Separation is safe. And in a second curly bracket, we'll write CFT dot, CFT dot set. And now let's check. It's not coming. Yeah. There should be a backslash. Yeah. Okay. Now we will set our line spacing by using set space package. So just right here. Just write double spacing. And then compile. Also we can uh, change our spacing for a particular section. So suppose I want to change here single spacing so just write to single spacing here i want to put uh, one half spacing also we can put some other uh, uh, value for our spacing so for that purpose we'll have to use spacing environment to put your value so i want to put three so to compare yeah Single spacing, one half spacing, three spacing, and this is a double spacing. You can also put customized uh, default spacing. So for that, uh, you will have to use here renew command. So just remove this and now use the renew command. So in a first bracket, we will write uh, baseline stretch. And in a second curly bracket, just uh, put your uh, customized uh, space. So I want to keep 2.5. Go to compile. Yeah. So we have this one single space, one half space, the triple space, and then uh, 2.5 space. Now we will introduce title set package and we will customize our chapter title and section, subsection, sub subsection title name, just like title set. And uh, we will use title format command. In a first curly bracket, we will write our uh, command name. So first I will change my chapter title. So here I will write chapter. And in a square bracket, we will define our uh, chapter shape. So there are lots of shapes are available uh, in the latex code. I would like to mention here. So here I will use a display and in a second curly bracket we will set our uh, formatting. So here I want to put my chapter in a red color. Also I want to put my chapter in a bold face. So I write a BF series. I want to put my chapter in the center of the page. So here I will have to write centering. And also we can set the font size here. 
सो जस्ट राइट हियर फॉन्ट साइज इन्हें फर्स्ट करली ब्रेकेट विल डिफाइन फॉन्ट साइज एंड इन्हें सेकेंड करली ब्रेकेट विल डिफाइन द लाइन स्पेसिंग एंड इन्हें फोर्थ करली ब्रेकेट विल डिफाइन लेवल सो आई वॉन्ट टू प्रिंट ओन इन नंबर फॉर चैप्टर सो जस्ट आई राइट हियर द चैप्टर एंड इन्हें फोर्थ करली ब्रेकेट विल डिफाइन दिटवीन चैप्टर एंड चैप्टर टाइटल इन ए फिफ्थ करली ब्रेकेट विल सेट टाइटल नेम फॉर्मेट सो हियर आई वॉन्ट टू पुट माई चैप्टर नेम इन ए अपर केस सो आई राइट हियर मे अपर केस एंड नॉम गो टू कम्पाइल Yeah, you can also print your chapter title name. So just write here chapter title name. Make a purchase. Go to compile. We can also increase space between chapter and chapter number by using some backslash. So just write here you uh, backslash between chapter title name and the, cha the chapter. Also, we can put our chapter and uh, chapter name in the same line. Just uh, change your shape. I want to use black. Yes. Yeah. Similarly, we will do for a section and subsection, also sub subsection. Now we will uh, change the space and we, uh, before starting chapter after chapter title. So for that, we will use title spacing. In the first curly bracket, we will define command name. So this is chapter. In a second curly bracket, we will put a uh, space. So left side space. Uh, first curly bracket is for the left side space. So I want to put zero point. Third curly bracket, I will write uh, also zero point. Zero point is the space before starting the chapter. This one is the space after chapter title. Now go to compile. Also, we can remove paragraph indent by using star. So just uh, here put star. Yeah. Now same thing we can do with uh, section subsection. Generally, we write section subsection sub subsection in this case in a stretch ability and shrink ability format. So we'll write here. So twelve point is our uh, default size. So here I'll write plus four point. Suppose I want to keep four point my stretch ability and minus four point for shrink ability. So this one is the space uh, before starting the section and after starting the section we can put the same thing or just put here zero point. Any value you, you can choose or if you don't want to use plus minus. Then use here star. Actually, it's not important to write plus minus. Even uh, you can put uh, actual value here, as like you have done in type in in a chapter. So it's not uh, important. And let me see. Yeah, it, it's working. And in the last, I would like to tell you something about justification of the text. So for uh, justification, we can use three commands: uh, plus right, plus left, and centering. So suppose I want to put my uh, this paragraph in a left uh, justification. So plus left is equivalent to right and right. Similarly, we can use plus right. And equivalent command, we can use right and left. We can use center environment. So just write begin. We can use similar command centering. Okay. Now this time we can see that our chapter font is also changing because we have used a title set uh, package and uh, also title format uh, command. So that's why it's working. We can also change our contents uh, font style in a handwritten font style, but uh, we'll have to use a title prop uh, package and then we'll have to customize. But today I don't have time to explain this, so maybe I'll explain it later in some other episode. Thank you for watching.